guys welcome back to my channel so i don't know if you recall last year but i did a video that was called like walmart versus target and basically we scoped out the back to school sections at those two stores and we compare like is walmart better or is target better of course results vary depending on where you live you know how close the stores are to you if you can even go to them but we're gonna try it again at my local stores in where i live in alabama so y'all know tax free weekend is coming up so i'm gonna show y'all what they got so let's go to target in the dollar spot you know right when you walk in <clears throat> what do we have here can grow you a little flower that's nice candy bar wrappers Okay, this kid's stuff. This ain't got nothing to do with it. Y'all are good. You're fine. My mom, I can't tell you how to close it. It's like sort of cute. You know, you got a little hey, teal theme. $3. A couple wraps. This is some pretty cheap makeup storage, though. I don't know Walmart. I mean, Dollar Tree has like, yeah, small ones for $4. So, I mean, you can, this is $3, but you can get this for dollar tree. So, then these little bins, I mean, you don't know what I would put in here. It's a little small. I do like this little soup container, though. It's really, I guess that's kind of dormy, right? Little dorm. Hmm. See, I could have sworn. Okay. Are you teaching the kids about money? That's cute. It is. I didn't see a lot for people our age. No. <laughs> Definitely children. Yeah, childish. Childish. Here we go. We have ran into our first. We not really focused on like bas basic stuff. Let's look at the cute items. So, pencil organizers, zipper pouches, that's, that's cute. We have journals, love the gold. I'm really sick of these hand signals though, so I wish they would leave that off. It's a little childish, but I mean, you know, this is marketed clearly for like, what? Middle school, high school. Yeah, carry a little laptop in there quality not that great i mean it's 14 dollars what's a do document never mind carry your documents in a little field i like getting a little dirty though we have these are nice though i kind of like that so that's craft stuff so here we go we have some post-it i actually like this but not for 5 dollars <laughs> we have two thousand 2019 planners okay design is decent you know you're not that into decorating we have a smaller version um, horizontal layouts so the color ones are still on the basic level Still the horizontal layouts. This one, yeah, it's this really one, easy. yeah. <clears throat> and that's our first look. Okay. We have your basic notebooks. You know, the same old, same old. But that's just how it is. Different colors, ninety-nine cents. this somewhere I don't want glitter pens though okay gel pens 30 count 12 12.99 pretty decent Ooh, that was right good those are 23.99 let's compare price 22 in here 22 pens basic binders more yubi 
Is that what it's called? I don't really see anything eye-catching yet, but I will venture through all the back to school. They have some midliners. Get a whole pack of midliners, $16.99. Those are great. Okay, we got more planners. Again, pretty basic, but I like this one because it includes stickers. You know how I feel about stickers. Yeah. So, that was nice. They have a smaller version, different color. I like the rose gold detailing. Oh, this is cute. This yeah. Is Who takes that many flights, though? Exactly. They could just put, like, a touchdown, like, you know, a location thing. But. <clears throat> Okay, you have this uh, notepad. You have three of them. So you have dot grid. You have a weekly plan. And then there is a note. That's pretty interesting. Got little notebooks. And you can actually circle the date on them. The pages are pretty thin though. So for this bulk note thing, it's probably five million. I think the notebook. I don't know y'all. This one is just lined, large. Got the desk calendars. Pretty basic, comes with orange and the pink. And then there's a smaller size. You want something smaller? So that's what we have there. On the next aisle, more notebooks. I have some faith journals. Okay, more basic school supplies. We all know what paper looks like. Okay, I mean, this is definitely where it's at, you know. Project 62. Okay, boom. See it, see it, definitely see it. You have gold pin unit there, $6.99. Gold tape holders, stapler. See you. I was legit by this. I was at like a phone thing. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna see if it works. Twenty one ninety nine. And it's like a book holder. Bookends. Okay. I see you with the brown. I might get this. like that it's more of the decor love the file folders this one is pink oh it comes with all three those are $4.99 that one's $12.99 the boxes are $16 the other side we have the bigger cork boards $9.99. That's pretty nice. No marble. If you want a weekly outline, don't want to do the whole calendar thing, that's cool. I wish it had Monday start instead of Sunday start, but that's just me. I don't like that stuff starts on Sunday. I want to start on Monday. Okay. Is it loud? Okay. See, so it works. It's kind of neat. More calendars. You know, we get a little more colorful here. Again, it sticks with the green throughout the planner. But definitely not on happy planner level or anything like that. But this one's pretty colorful. Different tab, different um, monthly views. Doesn't have that many pages in here. And planners are pretty cute just basic on the inside but personalization is up to you I like this one okay still with the horizontal you have your schedule and to do I feel like this one I also like this one why it's gotta be blue tabs they ruined it with the blue for me that one's decent Okay. 
back let's say this is this is just home stuff but let's just consider it back to school so laundry tote it's pretty decent you know just get it out the way $7.99 comes in black and white and a pink option hmm I don't think that's relevant that's kind of Oh well, yeah, if you need a utility cart, especially you moving in, moving out, you know, that can be useful. Okay, I see you, Dolly. I think somebody on my floor had bought one of those before. Yeah, that's $34.99. Ooh, she's gonna go buy one. She couldn't find one. People be holding them dollies hostage. Ironing board, okay, we got you in the gray and the and the teal, $9.99. Steamers. I don't know nobody with no steamer, but I'm pretty sure lots of people have steamers. Hmm. Okay, we got the rolling carts. These are really popular. Storage carts, y'all. They're $30, which is reasonable. They used to have them at Joann's and uh, Michael's. And I like the pink. So these are the $3.99, $5.99, y'all can see, and this one, $5.99 as well, okay, one is tall and one is short, and I will say that, I know I have like two, <laughs> these are $30, so if you're looking for one, Fluffy pillow. Mm. People have been really into these weighted blankets. So, yeah, 50, 70 weighted blanket, you know. So, this one is 6 pounds and this one is 100. No, I'm sorry, this is 12. <laughs> 12. So, yeah, have you into the weighted blankets? For shower caddies, we have these, you know, we have these as well. If you don't trust leaving your stuff in the bathroom with your roomie, get you one of those. Okay, so here's some dorm comforters. So we have this pink one, Twin XL. We have a little color for you. Got a reverse jersey knit. A blue speckled it's interesting it's a, throw bed. a throw bed okay if you just want to sleep on the floor Here we go back of the store school supplies
That's kind of cute. I like this theme. Yeah. These are interesting notes. Totally. Same concept throughout. Several organizers, pencil organizers. Okay, here we are in the backpack section. So these I'm gonna consider the kitty ones. Maybe one of you all would be interested in that one. Or the Puma is nice. I like that one. That's kind of cute. This has a hood to go with it. <laughs> That's interesting. Some of these are really cute. And we come over here with Cat and Jack. We have some more lunch bags book bags some more locker organization okay I see you I see you white and gold I see you furry rug I see you pom pom magnets this stuff is pretty cute so this section is pretty affordable the most expensive thing here is I see $14.99 so yeah Locker stuff just in the pink color, so okay. Got the little magnets, it's really cute. Okay, back to book bags. We have a floral leaf theme, some cherries. These are going for $44. The Trans by Jane Sport. Here are more $44, $35. $40, 36 yeah, these are about 35 These seem like they're doing too much for me, personally. I'm out of business. And got some basic black, you know, going for 70 whopping dollars. This one's kind of interesting. Got laptop space. Again, I really like this. And for this, for Puma, $30 not bad. Pretty reasonable, four dollars for these different designed bins. It's not bad. Twenty-two to thirty piece, and you can use those two pieces for other stuff. So that's decent. Six ninety-nine. Okay, all we are in a Walmart, and we will scope the back to school section, just like we did at Target. I'll show y'all a mix of a few dorm items, some supplies that they have and then the items that are more fashionable or themed i'll show you guys those as well so let's see these look like back to school with the little pencil looking things i don't really know okay 16.92 off the bat the book bags are cheaper but these are more again child you know kitty friendly but they're cheaper, most definitely. Not gonna pay too much in Walmart for book bags. Twelve eighty eight. See some simple mesh. You know, some schools we can only you can only do the little mesh. They got little lunch boxes, cool packs for lunch bags. Okay. I don't see anything more than sixteen dollars over here lunch it's a small book bag but I like that one <laughs> we have the folders starting at 15 cents I'm guessing that would be these Not 92 50 cents that's pretty cute just a binder that's 377 again more basic supplies Nothing really eye-catching on this aisle. 
those little note cards are kind of fun. Okay, a lot of pen and gear. We have the journals. And these are loaded with paper. And then we got the dot grid. Because y'all know dot grid is super in right now. We have the goldish yellow tassel. So we have the sunshine. A faux leather feel. This one is like a cloth field feel. Another one of those idea books. This is blank. Love this pink in the front. Walk by faith. Even when I can't see. Okay. We have good vibes with the pink and the gold corners. Again, this one is dot grid as well. Dot grid is really in. Lots of notebooks. This is a five subject. If you're not into like full size paper. We have. <clears throat> this is actually kind of neat. I've never seen one of these before. But you definitely can't turn in your assignments on this. But for note taking, I think this is pretty cool. Okay, so these were $2.97. Not bad at all. And these. Let's see. Here's another notebook with the pin loop on the front and also dot grid. I got you a nice little ruler inside so you can do dots and lines. So this whole planning thing with the dot grid has really become popular. And this appears to be $9. They have like legit dot grid is everywhere. Here's another, they have a little card on the inside there with the bullet key. So yeah, lots of bullet journals. Um, those have become popular. This one, is gonna do the pin on the outside, that's cool. And I'm pretty sure this one is six, was 10, six, 1076. They have very a variety of colors here. They have a uh, light, uh, I'm sorry y'all, this is one handed. They have a light pink with white and black on the edge. Yeah, they also have, see so again, these are dot grid. These are lined. Stencils. I think journaling has really come back. So these stencils are $4.64. You get alphabets. You get days of the week, get months, then some others. So I just went through the stencils and there are six different ones. One has like clothing items, um, different designs, some fun ones, shapes. Sticky notes, so I guess this would be for A5 type binder, but I have an A6 or a personal, so those wouldn't fit in mine, but it's cool. Pen tear tape. We have washi options, washi tape, washi. What she said? Okay, this is cute. And it comes with in a dispenser. Is that this one? So that's pretty good. I actually like this one. Lots of things for the stickers. I'm showing you guys this because I'm really into planning and I don't know if you guys are either but planning has become really mainstream especially with the decorating it makes me happy so <laughs> yeah there's unicorn you can really see the theme you have to look for it a little bit but all of these clearly go together and there's like a floral theme and there's a unicorn theme so if you want to put those items together you have to put in a little work, so I would imagine these would go with that. Lots of themes going.
and these were 88 cents a piece. You left. Yeah, I was like, I went through these aisles, but it's so much, you know, the sticker stuff get me. But yeah, yeah the notepads here. I'm pretty sure these aren't that expensive, but I think those were cool. I haven't even got to the sticker book yet, so yeah, it's pretty nice, guys. So 703 stickers in this book for two dollars and eighty-eight cents, y'all. Yay, nay, notes. You got washi strips. You have weather trackers. Yo, these look just like the ones in the Happy Planner. You have numbers. Lots and lots of. Yeah. And all the pages on the back there. 981. So checklists, boxes, emoticons, activities more numbers check boxes Ooh, groceries appointments lock key bills grocery shopping yeah i like this one begin with the more i might get this one <laughs> yeah that one this is 280 288 so yeah those with these have and again these are 288 and the third book somebody open this up for y'all so good looking at this one has 726 we have okay the days of the week more emoticons okay we have to-do list thoughts ideas notes more days of the week if you want to do like a tracker um emails appointments meeting i used to appointments for when i have one-on-ones <laughs> This is like the same page, y'all, out of my book. Maybe it wasn't Happy Planner. Maybe it was actually this. I feel bamboozled because I bought one of these in the sticker sheet and I could have sworn it was Happy Planner. Anyway, it's 642. Ooh, this one is nice as well. We also have these planner pouches here with some stickers. We have some magnetic clips. We have a pin loop. Yeah, elastic pin, elastic band and pin loop. Two rows of washi, bookmarks, and then you get the pouch and 33 stickers. And it comes in other color themes. So that one's nice. There's a blue. Blue, purple, green. Seem to have a pin pouch and stickers so this one comes with the dashboard inserts the magnetic so that's cool the basic pins and all again we have the fancy notebooks the most expensive seem to be 48 we have some 324 some cute notebooks there and then paper we all know about paper looking for aerial rugs you know walmart has it for 20. we have some furry silver and white we have a sparkle in silver okay for comforter stuff for back to school we have these $45. That one looks interesting. Actually, I had a pillow that color, so this has been a theme for a minute. Nothing new here, but these blankets are super nice though. I own a couple. yeah so we have more body pillow covers here that one's nice then you have a donut one there's a silky one blue white the comforters we have more that was nice Ooh. they also have a twin Those aren't bad. 
have the basic caddy stuff. You know they're going to be a dollar at Walmart for the caddies that look like this. Have the pop-up hamper for $48. We have the bed risers for $5.97. The trash cans. So here's the like the color themed ones, the two sided. Okay. Okay, pink and burgundy. Got the bistles, the handbags, and the lights. If you want one that has the charger port, two charger ports. Are nice. I get for four dollars in Walmart. They're three seventy-seven, and I think they have brighter colors. So that's one thing that I did see at Target. Basic school supplies. I actually need this. That's pretty cute. Love the pink one. Here we go. Some containers, pencil cases. That's really nice. Ooh, like that one. Pin and gear. We have what? Is this a three piece set? Yeah, that's nice. Good purse organi organization as well. These have two pockets, very colorful. Ooh, that's very, can be someone's aesthetic. These are pretty good as well. The dress the pouches. There's basic school supplies. Let's see. Okay, so we made it to like the journal owl. Ooh. Let's see guys. This is really cute. Ooh. So that's like that for every month. You have some lists and ideas, like goals. You can put pictures. I think that's pretty cool. This one is still basic. Let's see what the actual pages look like. Horizontal theme, but different colors. It's still pretty plain. But I think that's nice. They have the traveler's notebook. They have two journals in here. This is actually pretty nice. Like, I'm not going to lie to y'all. That's pretty nice for a traveler's notebook. Then I have a whole book with dot grid. So it comes with the two books in here. They have this in a gray color and a pink. I don't know if the themes are different in those. So that one had the gold. Yeah, gold. And this one. This one has a gray book and then it has a silver. For the pink, we have a gray dot and then, ooh, I love that right there. We have week of Monday. I actually like this. Like, I feel like I want this. And then we have another dot grid for notes and stuff. I love this. I like that. Of course, on the side, you have three pocket and then you have a secretarial pocket right there in the back you do have a pin loop and there's an extra pocket in the back and i'm pretty sure yeah that's the same for all of them there were more the 88 cent stickers and there's a whole bunch you have to really look though oh now these notes are so cute these are 188 these are 188 and there's a purple theme that's cute what else? Is this the same one? This one is different too. More planners. These are more dot grid. People are really on that dot grid wave. And they come in different colors here. That one is like a pink marble. That one's nice as well. The design is pretty similar on there though. This one is a little different theme. Still the same concept as the last two, but the way that the the pages are set up is more simple. Type girl, they have you. 
right here with the binders pretty small 664 for all of those types the big calendars those are basic this one that's pretty basic man I'm weak basic There are several more sticker books. I do like this pink and a black and white one. Then we have the notebooks again. We kind of saw some of those before. We have the basics, again with the paper, and some of the one subjects. Those are simple. Again, we have some cute binders. That one's nice. Ooh, love the pink stuff. Love the sparkles. So guys, that was me scoping out the back to school sections in Target and Walmart. I hope you all got some ideas. Um, personally, I think I still enjoyed the vibe for the back to school stuff at Walmart the most. Target, I don't know if I wasn't looking in the right areas, but I did find the actual back to school section, but I still feel like Walmart has come up especially with the decor stuff a little bit well i think target's dorm decor may be a little better but for the stationary type items i think i'm feeling a walmart more um, when i showed you some target stuff i believe that was more the home office section so i don't know if you consider that back to school and i didn't really venture that far into walmart but this is what their back to school section is looking like so Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.